Hello, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to make some lovely lemon pickle. I've cut 10 lemons from my garden. As you can see, they are almost getting ripe. So I rinsed and I cut the top of the stem out. Over here, I've caught about a liter of water and I've caught my stove on moderate heat so the water is heating up while the water is heating up I'm gonna put in my lemons into the water now I'm gonna allow this lemon to boil for 10 to 15 minutes but I'll keep checking I wouldn't want it to get very soft 10 minutes has passed us and I just checked on the lemons they are nice still firm I don't want it to melt away so now I'm ready to strain the water from the lemon and then thereafter I'll allow it to cool completely. Now my lemons are cooled down completely and you can see it's not over boiled. So I'm going to cut these lemon into quarters. If there are any seeds like these, now is the time to just remove them. Otherwise, these seeds cause a lot of bitterness. Here's my lemon, which I cut in quarters, and I took as many seeds as possible out. For this, I've caught a teaspoon of sugar and a teaspoon of salt to add in so it seeps into the lemon. And here I have vinegar. So I'm going to measure my vinegar in. Till it just go over the lemons. Okay, that was two cups of uh, vinegar. Now this lemon will be kept in the vinegar to rest overnight and tomorrow I will complete making of the pickle so I will catch y'all shortly okay it's the next day and we are back we are today to complete making our lemon pickle yesterday I showed y'all how I soaked my lemons in the vinegar and it was the overnight stay and I kept on uh, mixing it several times. So today I'm ready to prepare my pickle. The ingredients are I've got one tablespoon of pickle masala, two tablespoons of pure masala and four cloves of garlic that I chopped finely and to start off I've got a cup of oil which is direct from the gallon. For this moment we are not going to add salt because yesterday I did add salt to my lemon but after a few days of uh, uh, mixing my lemon while it sets we will taste the salt and then if possible we will add a little salt. So firstly I'll take my lemon out 
from the vinegar put it into a, another bowl these lemons are not necessary to dry up you can mix it directly so it has a moisture finish usually whenever i soak uh, my pickles for making with vinegar i don't throw away my vinegar i keep them and then when soaking the pot a burnt pot with vinegar it removes the burnt mark otherwise you can put in your spoons or knives and forks overnight in your vinegar and it will glitter after washing the next day so it brings a lot of uh, use to the vinegar that we use and this vinegar that is smelling so nice with the lemon i can wash up my dish cloths and it will give a beautiful lemon smell I'm adding in my pickle masala my pure chili powder to give it a nice color and then in grow my chopped garlic I give this a good mix and I'm going to add in my cup of oil that I have Now my pickle is all mixed up and done. So what I'm going to do is, I've got my airtight glass bottle that I sterilized earlier. So I'm going to pack it in and you have to let it sit for a week before eating. This recipe was given to me from my eldest sister who's very fond of making uh, pickles and many different types of pickle as she's none other than Azel's mother. Thank you very much my sister Radha. Thanks for sharing all the pickle recipes that you give me. I hope my viewers try and enjoy. Thank you all for watching.